What is up guys, Shadows here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set up Trip on Windows. So you'll download Trip from hashtag releases in the Discord, and once you have the .zip, you just want to drag it to your desktop. And after doing so, you can either right click and extract all, or you can double click on .zip, and you see this folder, and double click again, and move the main trip.io folder to your desktop. And while this is completing, you can remove the .zip, put it in your recycle bin. When it's done completing, and you'll have the main trip.io folder. So after this, you just want to double click on it, and you'll see all the files inside. Do not remove the trip.io and put it on your desktop as like a shortcut, because this will cause problems and it needs all the files to run. So you just want to double click on trip.io, and you'll see the user interface pop up. And in settings, this is where you enter your key. So when you're entering your key, make sure not to leave any spaces because users are saying that their key does not work, but something as simple as a space will mess everything up. Discord webhook basically means that when the bot is pressing process payment on Supreme, they'll try to find a confirmation number if possible and send it to your Discord channel of your choice. And this is add to card delay and checkout delay, all preference. On profiles, when you're creating a new profile, you can just press the plus sign. For example, I name mine Shadow and create. And I'd enter all my information. And when you're entering your telephone number, make sure to space it out like this. This would be one, two, three, one, two, three, and then the last four. And after that, your card number will automatically be formatted. So as you can see, boom. And when you're done with everything, you just want to press save. And task config, this is where all the magic happens. So if you want to use headless, you have to use a keyword. And headless means that you won't see the Supreme page until it gets to checkout. And multi mode means that you can select multiple items at the same time. So let's say I wanted a tee, a sock, and an underwear. I click on the tee and then it'll add to cart and then go back to the accessories category. I click on the socks, so it'll go back, and then the underwear, it'll go back. And when using a keyword, make sure to capitalize the first letter. So it'll be like T and color, say black, and then size would be large. And when you're using proxies, you can use IP authorization proxies or user browse proxies. And you wanna follow IP port format. So for example, if this was my proxy, I'd enter this part. And if they were user pass, when the bot loads up Chrome, It'll ask to authenticate them and there you go and timer when you're using a timer you want to set it to your computer time so for example my time is 11 39 and i do 11 let's say i want it to run at 40 i do 40 say 10 seconds in and then pm and then i would be set and after that i just press run another thing if your bot's not running you can also right click on the trip.io and press run as admin or you can re-download the chrome driver from google and drag the updated one into the folder and if it still doesn't work just let us know in discord and we'll try to help all right good luck